So what does it mean to migrate to Drupal 8? And what indeed is the process of migration? And then how is each phase of the migration process controlled? Well, first of all, migrating to Drupal 8 is simply importing data from external sources into Drupal. Now this might be previous Drupal versions. It might also be from CSV or JSON, another database or some other data store. The process of migrating data is known as an ETL process. And in computing terms, this is really talking about the data warehousing. So in an ETL process, that's the E stands for extract, the T is transform, and L is load. And in Drupal terms, each of these phases is controlled by plugins. So if you think about the ETL process, we have source process and destination. I'll illustrate that quickly with a couple of graphics. So we have our miner, which is our extract phase, and then a little factory for the transform phase, and then finally, a nice fast Drupal 8 race car for our load phase. And in Drupal terms, each of these stages is controlled by plugins. So we have source plugins controlling the extract phase, process plugins controlling the transform phase, and then destination plugins controlling the load phase. So to recap, the migrate system allows for importing content from external sources into Drupal 8. It provides an upgrade path for previous versions of Drupal, and migrations are ETL processes, which are controlled by plugins.